Hi everyone, today is January 5th, 2021. I'm gonna take you through our workout. Today is a strength workout. Okay, we are focusing on three lifts. You will have 12 minutes for each lift uh, to complete for as much weight as possible. We're obviously looking for technique and form. It is the beginning of the month, January, so we wanna make sure that we document all of the weight that we're able to complete. You can even try to do yourself a favor so you can check your technique and videotape yourself uh, watch your form, check in with the coach, and just make sure you're doing these things properly. All right, <clears throat> so we have power clean, strict press, and the overhead squat. Um, all challenging movements, okay, the overhead squat, we did some squat mobility yesterday, so we're gonna keep those concepts in mind uh, from when we were working with our wall ball. But let's start with the power clean. So the power clean, actually, let me use an empty barbell so it looks a little bit better. So the power clean, the barbell starts all the way on the ground, and then you're essentially catching it in a power position. So we get into a deadlift position. So you're gonna stand jump, catch the bar on your shoulders for one rep. We're not looking to go all the way down below parallel with this one, so we're not looking for a squat clean. We're looking for um, us to catch it high. So we're looking for a good setup, okay? You're gonna keep your back flat, engage the lower, lower back and extend, all right? Uh, knees are <clears throat> pulled back a little bit, but pressed out. Shins are slightly forward, a little bit different than your traditional deadlift. Okay, we're gonna be in this more upright torso setup. From here, you're gonna to start to deadlift the bar. Okay, once you get it into your hip, from here, notice I'm still bent. I'm gonna jump the barbell up and then catch it in that front rack position. We're looking for a power position. So we're not, we shouldn't be uh, all the way down into a full squat. We should just be touch about parallel or higher. One rep is all you need, okay? Uh, so we're looking to complete that for max weight. 12 minutes to, to complete that. Then we have the strict press. So we're locking everything out from the ground, keeping our elbows down in the front, creating a strong foundation. From here, you're gonna take a deep breath, tuck your head, press all the way up over your head, and then bring the bar back down. Pretty straightforward with that one. But with this though, when you press, you wanna make sure everything's in one line. Okay, you don't wanna be here, zigzag okay you don't want to be uh leaning too far forward or you don't want the bar in front of you when you're leaning back okay you want to make sure that your your hand or the wrist the elbow the shoulder the torso hips knees and leg uh, feet are all in one straight line in that finish so that's your strict press now the overhead squat we're going to get we can use a rack we can set ourselves up like a back squat just with that wide grip. Once you pull the bar out, <clears throat> you can do a behind the neck jerk. So it's dip, jump, land, and then stand all the way up. From here, we're gonna hold onto the barbell, we're gonna squat all the way down, and then stand all the way up. So we're looking to stabilize the load overhead. Okay, arm hits are forward, hips are going back and uh, down, knees are tracking out. So if you noticed yesterday, we did some squat therapy before we did the wall balls. Okay, so some things we were talking about today a lot in the group classes was your knees are tracking out instead of forward, okay? And your hips are going back, you're creating a little curve in your lumbar spine, and then your chest and your torso is maintaining an upright position. Then we were able to get our hands all the way up and reach that full range of motion at the shoulder. So we're looking for the same concepts uh, today with our overhead squat. Okay, uh, again, you have 12 minutes for each. Try to get as much weight as possible. You get that overhead squat, uh, you need to modify, go ahead and do front squats, okay? Or you can also do back squats if overhead mobility is an issue. All right, that's our workout today. Make sure you note your score, uh, your weight to sugar what? Have a good workout.